Good day, hope you're doing well. In today's quick video, I'm going to share a trick that you can use in Darktable to get rid of color moray if, it, if that is affecting your images. So sometimes the pattern of uh, a product that you're photographing is interfering with your sensor and you get these patterns. Like you can see here in the bottom left corner of this box, you, you get this elliptical pattern of green, purple, green, purple, etc. And you can also see it here on top of this box so you have the you know the purple green purple green um, um, interference so this is not what the box looks like the box is just gray there there aren't any colors so one trick that you can use in dark table is to actually add a little bit of surface blur so you just type in surface blur you can activate it and you can see nothing much is happening and in fact we need to do a little bit more um, the default values for this photograph do not work particularly well so what i'm going to do is first i'm going to change the blend mode because that's really the key of this uh, trick you're going to change the blend mode from normal to chromaticity because it's colors that you want to correct to a certain extent so we're just going to change it to chromaticity and then you need to fiddle with these numbers so you have a radius which is 15 by default and then you have red green and blue so the three channels and they have some kind of very small default value. Now for this image I found that 0.02 in all three channels and I actually like to keep all these numbers the same. I mean across the three channels I like to, to keep them the same. Um, the radius in this case didn't really make a big difference so I'm just going to leave that to 15 or maybe reduce it a little bit. Now it's coming back slightly so let's just leave it at 15 and if I switch it on and off you can really see the before and after. It's a dramatic improvement. And um, yeah, that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, feel free to leave a comment. Feel free to give it a like if you like the video, obviously. And um, or even subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much for watching and see you the next time. Bye bye.